welcome to Daniel's Prayer Program. The Bible says in 1 Thessalonians 3 verse 7, So we have been greatly encouraged in the midst of our troubles and suffering, dear brothers and sisters, because you have remained strong in your faith. For our first prayer item, let's pray for our people to be encouraged and have prudent faith in this season. Let's all pray fervently and with joy. Father God, we call you. Thank you so much, O Lord, for the powerful name of Jesus Christ. Pray God for our people, Lord God, that they will encourage that they will be right there in their very inside, in their hearts, that they encourage God to keep on believing in the Lord, in the promises of God, to keep on believing, to be encouraged in the promises of God to happen in their lives. Father, we thank you. As they begin to read the word, Lord, they continue to hear the word. Faith to arise, Father. Faith comes by hearing, hearing the word of God. Pray God that prudence will be right there again along with their doctors. They'll be prudent, O Lord God, in the action they do. Prudent God in the action they do, especially when they go out to us. We pray, Father, for prudence, God. They would go to every Lord, that they would take refuge. That they would avoid the crowded places that are not only being for the folks. Father God, we pray. Jesus name, Lord God. Let us be upon our people, Lord God. Still, we got to give them the encouragement they need in order to keep on believing and trusting, Lord, depending on the Lord and the Word of God. So we thank you, God, for you do this. God, what they believe in them to pass. Lord, as they can see, it becomes effective. Faith be perfect, oh God, and strong. Thank you, Lord. In the name of Jesus Christ, God. Oh, Lord God, when they believe shall come upon us, based from your word, so we thank you now in the name of Jesus Christ. Our people shall be prudent, God, for God, wise in every decision they may be doing, God. Lord God, they will be encouraging God, always encouraging their hearts, Lord God, and they will not give up, and they will not worry, but they will be encouraged through the power of the word of God. We thank you now for your grace. Now, God, because we know it's the word, God, what happens in the person's heart. So it is you, God, who works in us. Lord, you are doing and desire the things you want us to do, God, and desire your will. Father, let it be for your people. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen and amen. Amen and amen. Now for our next prayer item, we will be praying for the double restoration of our nation, more businesses and job opportunities for our people. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, Father Lord, God, Lord, Lord, we pray for you once again, Lord God. We thank you for the because you are the God of the rest of the world. And when you restore us, Lord, we have lost the rest of the world. Lord, we pray for our land, for our nation, and we pray for our nation. God, 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 we pray for Lord, 
Amen. For our next prayer item, we will be praying for the young people to grow deeper in their relationship with God. So let us all lift our voices to the Lord. Father, we Father come before God, you we once come again. Come you come the Lord, because God, you are faithful. Lord, our young people, Lord, we lift up to you all the young people. Father, we lift up to you all the young God, we know you more and more. We thank you that you are faithful. Thank you that you are faithful. Thank you for more of your presence, O God, for more of your word. I pray, O God, that every time they will read their word, write out for more of the ocean, O God, that they have to catch up their hearts Lord, just one encounter with you and they will be thousands again. If they never go alone in their relationship with you, oh God, and I pray, Lord, that your presence, oh God, will surround them all the days of their lives. Lord, thank you, because I know that we will continually serve the young people, Lord God, be closer to you, Lord God. Thank you so much, Lord, because even if they're being alone, Lord God, you serve the word that they say, God, we pray. Amen. And now let's pray for restoration to full health and strength for COVID patients. Let us all pray. Heavenly Father, Father God, Father, oh, we thank you so much, Lord, for you, 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 Lord, for you
that you are the ones who 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 are the Lastly, we want to pray for our solo parents to be patient and be filled with faith for the future of their children. Now, let us lift up our voices and let us pray. Father God, thank you so Father much. Father God, we pray God for God. those who are coming to our lives. Now, Lord, lift up the future of God. 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 Lord, l